What's going on everybody? Welcome back. Today we have another MTB Pro unboxing for April. Super excited about this one. I've already sneaked a peek and this is probably one of my favorite MTB boxes yet. Let's jump right into the diddle and see what we got. First, we have the Bagley Pro Sunny B Twin Spin. This is listed to be $12.99. Bagley Pro Twin Spin. This is gonna be a top water bait, very similar to the old torpedo baits that used to be made. Uh, you can do this a couple different ways. You can kind of use work it like a popper, or you can just use a standard retrieve, just a standard nice steady retrieve. Top water bait. This has got some great colors to it. It definitely looks like a shad with a yellow belly. Uh, super excited about this one. This one should be great for a lot of ponds, a lot of lakes. This is gonna be just a great all around bait. Something a little bit smaller that you can throw, not necessarily as large as like a whopper plopper or anything like that. This is gonna get bit all over the place as soon as the top water bite gets real. Next up, we have the Biospawn Exoswim. These beasts. These are gonna be an awesome, awesome thing that you can use as a trailer. You can use this as a standalone swim bait. You can even use this and throw it on the back of like a buzz bait or uh, use it as like a skinny dipper, which is a new thing I've learned to use. This is gonna be a great all around bait. You can use this for a ton of different things, a ton of different techniques. This is listed to be $5.99. Next up, we have the Spinner Bait Trailer Hook by Stickies. You guys know that I like Stickies. Uh, this come is a one pack, so there's only one in here. Uh, I I'd like to have a few more, but what can you say? You know, this is a great piece. Uh, I still love that logo. I still think that thing is awesome. Uh, super cool. Let's get this out of the box. Show you guys exactly what this is. Boom. Beautiful little trailer hook. We can use this on all sorts of stuff. Uh, and we're gonna have to go directly to the Catchco spinner bait because you can pair that up with this, put it on the back, it's gonna increase your hookup ratio. This is a beautiful uh, spinner bait here. This is just a gorgeous spinner bait. It's gonna have those willow leaves on here, one in gold, one in silver. It's gonna be a 3 8 ounce. Uh, I mean, spinner baits are gonna be one of the most classic bass fishing lures really of all time. Uh, this is something that you can just use almost all year round and catch bass anywhere. Um, I mean, you cannot really go wrong with a spinnerbait. If you had to put one lure in a box, I mean, a spinnerbait you'd almost have to use everywhere. They're relatively weedless depending on the body of water, depending on, you know, uh, you just can't go wrong with a good spinnerbait. And now I'm just going to have to have a hook on the floor. Big Bite Baits Limit Maker. This is gonna be a great little drop shot lure. Set this up with your drop shot. Um, you could even use this as a trailer, but gorgeous little color here. Do they list the color? I always get confused by these Big Baits bags because they don't really list uh, colors or anything, which always kind of drives me a little crazy. You can use this for a drop shot. You can use this um, almost like a Ned Rig also. Have it kind of crawl across the bottom. It'll give you a little bit of action. And with this color, pretty fantastic. So this is gonna be something that can be used really early, early spring. When the water's still a little cold, those fish are gonna be a little lackadaisical um, and they don't wanna do much. So this can also get you bit. I like throwing stuff. Next up, we have the Lucky John Chunk Tail. This is listed for $3.99. These are uh, little grubs little traditional grubs that work great with a bunch of different things. I actually find that these work fantastic on the back of a chatterbait. You throw this on the back of a chatterbait and for some reason the way that this tail works, it just, they love it. So little grubs, there's a ton of different ways you can obviously throw this. You don't have to throw it on the back of like a buzz bait. You can throw it on the back of a spinner bait. You can throw it on the back of like a net, like of just a standard jig head and kind of jig with this off of the side of a boat. You can throw, cast it out, drag it across the bottom. 
great lure. Um, I've always kept a stash of grubs in my bag. I always have a small stash of them just for trailer tails, all sorts of stuff. And this is a great little combination here. Um, it's got a strong fish or shrimp scent. Uh, it's called the color of bait fish and it's a 2.9 in length. So, and I really like the feel of these. The texture on this one is super cool. Highly suggest checking it out. Next up, we have the Boyd Ducket BD Square Bill, listed for $7.99. Oh, this dude's a tank. This is cool. Boom. Let's out of the packaging and take a look. Square bills catch fish. Uh, you kind of reflect them, or deflect them, deflect, not reflect. Deflect them off of wood. You can throw these things just really anywhere. Edges of grass lines. They're gonna get bit. This is a big, chunky one. It's got a great look to it. It's gonna have like a shad color. It's got some rattles inside, which is just fantastic. Uh, and what's cool about this specific piece is we also have the hook bonnet. Uh, so these, are really cool. Let's open them up so you can see what I see. Now, this comes with, it looks like, seven of these little plastic guys, these little plastic pieces here. Now, what you do with these is so for, say, the back of this, you have these treble hooks. And if you know, you put these in one of your tackle boxes and they get all over the place. You take these, you set them into where the hook is, they kind of clip in, and now your hooks aren't gonna get all tangled up. So we can put one on each of these, like so. Boom. Now you have a way that you can grab on your lure, you can set it down without having to you know, worry about your foot getting hooked on it, getting it snagged on a shirt. Um, or put it in your box and not have to worry about it getting tangled with all the other hooks. An easy way to keep your lures from getting all tangled up. Fantastic. Let's run the numbers and see what this month's MTB Pro Box comes out to be. All right, so for April, if you got the MTB Pro Box that I got, it runs a total retail of 4208. I get the box. For $25 delivered. That is a steal and a half. Thank you guys so much with MTB. I absolutely love doing these unboxings. If you see it, hey, I love you guys. Keep up the great work. And until next time, guys, happy foozing.